Hello and welcome back to Paper Mario The Origami King. We're here fighting every boss in the game a second time so that we can get one of our last few collectibles, which brings us to colored pencils. One of the most vicious office supplies known to man. All right, so we got these tiles. The, okay, so the missile locations don't change. I'm gonna go thousand arms as early as possible. Let's see how it goes. I'm supposed to smack it with the hammer. I mean, it's the same like whacking motion. I feel like it would work, right? Nope, it was the wrong- oh! Oh, okay. That was the right time to do that. Alright, um... But what is the hint now? Alright, so that's gonna send me up here. Uh, let's use... this and this and see if I can just do a bunch of damage. Oh no. That's not what I'm supposed to do. in a better spot. Alright, now I think I should go around to the front. See where this puts me. Well, this side would work too. I'll throw in the on switch just so that's ready, but then hit it with an attack. See if this works. It seems like this tile disappears the other times I'm trying to use it. So maybe it'll help me do more damage in this part. I can't see that happening, but meh, worth a try.
Okay, so right now I'm going through here. I'm gonna get an extra attack out of this. I wonder if we could do this and then I hit both of those and then get an attack. So I move to the right, up, right. Yeah, that's looking good. Let's try the boots. So they do about the same damage. Alright, I think I'm supposed to get to the side of him now. So let's do this. All right, let's see if it works. Well, the pencils just follow me. Hopefully this is the right thing to do. Man, man, do your worst. Okay, my guy is actually kind of helping me this first round. Because so I can move... I think that's going to bring things the way that I want them. Let's get a hint in there, and so I still, I think, get everything done that I want to. Thanks. I was matching the A button. Mario just didn't react. Youch. Okay, well, kind of need that heart. Except I can't really get it. Alright, does this work? I move to that side, I grab those things, and then... Oh, it's not gonna work, is it? Mm. 
Oh gosh. Um. Well, that wasn't the worst thing that could have happened. Just dodging this rubber bind move is annoying because of the camera angles. Okay. All right, so that's gonna send me on a path through here, and then it, I'll, it'll move me up. Boy. Okay. So it's gonna send me up one and around. Well, couldn't get close this time, but hopefully this is enough for his measly HP stat. Well, that's weird. What am I supposed to do? I assume hit him with the arms thing, because every time I attack him otherwise, he doesn't respond. Guess I'll try and attack. giving me the same hint.
Oh, wow. All right, all comes down to this one turn. Let's make sure this is on and make sure we get this. And I think we should be good for good measure. Shall we grab a heart? Yes. So I move into the heart and up the on button. Okay. Man, I got worried there. He did 25 damage just dodging my my thing. He would have taken me out if I didn't get that heart. Wow. These are way harder because you don't have like your toad hints and stuff like that. Goodness. All right, let's get into a hole punch. The Disco Man. That's right. I forgot how that worked. Hmm. Let's see. Well, I'm going to end up moving here. What if I do this? Then I'll end up on his side. If I do this, then I end up right behind him. Very nice. And then I can make this appear. And I think that's that's a good turn. So it doesn't activate. The yellow body's really tough. He's hiding in a vulnerable spot somewhere. The rubbery back on him. All right, let's get him with the flashy hammer. Oh no! Dude, where's my face? I forgot how this whole thing went. Uh... Well, I still can't use that on switch. Um... back I think it's through the treasure chest oh no Mario's face is just like chilling there okay I guess that'll function as my health all right so right now that's the way I'm gonna move I have to get my face back if something could send me moving that way that would be flawless Like this. So that's gonna move me, but it moves you through all the holes too, so I don't think that actually works. Ooh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. I'm also running out of time, so you boys gotta make some moves. Can't do that, Arrow. Um, I guess I could attack him from the side. That's all I got. Oh, thank goodness it also brings back the other part of my HP. All 
Now this isn't going to do too much damage, but, you know. Okay. Oh, zero damage. Alright, so if I move this way, I... Oh, man, the, the on switch is still disabled. That's really what's happening here. I think that gets me in a good place. Yeah, it's behind him, depending on which way he's dancing. <laughs> Up to his special attacks. We gotta hit an on switch and we gotta hit a value mental. Um, Alright, so right now I'm going into this spot. So if I do that and then hit this up, then I'm clear. And then as an added bonus, can I give myself anything? Doesn't look like it. Uh, I'll try doubling the damage, see if that actually sticks. And we'll call that good. Oh, I thought I'd, like, flip him over or something. Hopefully this guards me. Yeah! That flipped him over. Alright, now I'm gonna try and line up a, um... hand thing. Let's see, can I slide this forward? Yes, but at what cost? Ugh, the sliding never works for me. <laughs> What if I do this, though? Okay, so that's one slide. I get two more. Ah, uh, can't make that work. Okay. Um, all right, so right now I'm going left and then up. If I can make this an on sign and then make this in a hand symbol, then I can do this. Okay, I think that's my best move. It's not the best placement, but hopefully this works. Oh, what happened? Did I not tear it off? Oh, I just can't guard that, can I? Unless he starts charging up, I think I'm in a place where I could almost just win. Yes, uh, I probably will want to hit that switch. So I'm gonna hit this um, eventually, then go up. And if I can do something here. Hmm. So naturally, I am going to hit that on switch. I just want an up arrow to be better placed. Let's see, can we do this? And we could do... This, and then just slide this down one. Thanks. <laughs> the tips are always so unrelated. All right, what kind of items do I have?
They really know how to drag these out, don't they? Alright, so I just need to hit a turtle. Um, right now, I'm going to do that close by. If I just move this. But how can I also get my face in there? I can't. Okay, well, whatever. Whatever. smash my face too hard. Yeah, that almost got him. Almost got him right there. Alright, I don't need to complicate this. I'm gonna go in through here and finish this thing. No need for a flashy finish when you're not getting coin bonuses anyway. Alright, now we got the tape. Alright, so what I want to do is attack him from the sides. I'll take that treasure chest and a hint. Thank you very much. Hit the tape dispenser with your hammer. Wow, what a tip. Really looking out for us here. Okay, um, I think I'd like to end up on the other side of this fella. Where does this put me? That's gonna put me, um... Yeah, it's okay. Okay, I think now I want to get onto the other side of him. Uh, I don't really know the best way of doing. So that'll send me right here. Okay. Perfect. I think I need to get excellent here. It's not gonna really like count. Or maybe not. Bummer is how much damage I'm taking. Like, my goodness, fella. Uh, okay. I think. Hmm. 
That should be good. Alright, this puts me, well, on this side. Okay, that's, that's fine. I just make sure that there's one of these here, and then one of these here that will send me to the left, and then up right, and then up into the attacking position. I'd love to grab a heart, but... It's the weird part about doing these the rerun boss battles. Just don't get the chances you'd like to use items and heal cheering toads and stuff. Alright, so right now I end up, if I move that fighting symbol, through a lot of those things. Not exactly where I want to end up. So let's try and do... That might be perfect. Because I can use my flashy hammer here, which will end it, and then I can use a mushroom. That wasted the tile and my ability to. Okay, whatever. We'll live, I guess. All right, so this is right now going to send me up into the magic circle, except it's not. How do I reach that magic circle? Okay, what I'd rather do is go up and then to the side. It pretty much gets me everything I want. It'd be nice if that magic circle was a ring closer. Let's see here. Oh gosh. Okay, I, I don't have the option to do that anymore. Um, okay, I'm just gonna have to go with this. Oh, a heart, thank you. Justice is served. <laughs> <laughs> Goodness gracious, got that boy. Okay, so one thing I'll want to hit is the on switch, because eventually I'll want to burn up this tape, which I do by um, 
getting to the Firebird, which, oh, it doesn't look, okay, I actually can. And then if I want to, I could probably put something else there, but that'll probably just overcomplicate it, so I think I'm just gonna stick with what I've got. This will also burn, this will burn up the tape that's on the field and I think do 20 damage. Alright, now what do we have here? Ah, but we do not have the magic circle! Um... I mean, okay. I don't think we can do everything this turn. That's when it gets a little frustrating with boss battles in this game, is that you're kind of just stuck waiting for certain things to happen. Like, I need to turn the on switch, and then I need to get to the Thousand Arms, because attacking him is going to do no damage at all. Which I wish it wasn't so binary. I wish that there's more of a choice with how you fight bosses. Maybe you like going for the special attacks, maybe you like a, a duel, but there's kind of a right and a wrong way to play these. Okay, now I need to absolutely hit this um, treasure chest, which I guess I could get a heart and then get the treasure chest. And then it doesn't really matter what I do. Um, I guess I could also use an item or something. Pretty sure if I jump on him, I, I I can't do that, so just keeping it safe with the hammer. I suppose I could also use a shiny fire flower. Let's see how that does. Cool. All I need to focus on getting to is that Thousand Arms uh, spot right now. Um, that's not gonna work. Does this work? I can't slide this out of the way, can I? I cannot. Okay. That's not gonna work. This could work if I could... Oh, okay, so move up and then to the right, and then to the right more, to the right. Okay, that, that just like loops. I don't think there's a way for me to do it. Oh, what do I do while he's spinning? Oh, 
Okay, looks like my chance to beat it was last turn and now this turn. Kind of in a tough spot. But this will send me around and then into the fire value mental, so... Okay, and I've got almost full HP. I don't imagine a special attack is going to take me out. Okay, looks like that's the right move, so we will do that. Okay, can I get onto an on switch? And then, oh, I could probably cook something here. So, so this is gonna send me up and then to the left so I can uh, then go up here. And then do this. So just to check, I go up that way and then to the side, get the heart, get the times two. Then I run through on switch and thousand arms. Sounds like a deal. You're done, buddy. You're finished. Well, that's going to be the end of this episode. Join me next time as we get into the rest of the boss battles and hopefully claim that trophy as the adventure continues in Paper Mario The Origami King.